not 100% sure. Shh, it's starting. Let's get into it. you oh shit ha 20 orange granddad <laughs> looky there he's awake you daft don't go in there shut it he's in chains can't do a thing am i right master gerald <laughs> oh. Again! Why? The dice didn't roll! Calling me a cheat? Take it back! Look, he's awake again! Monster slayer, my ass. A regular horson. I heard witches all start out as roadside orphans taken in by mages. Mages who experiment on them. <laughs> Folks say they plow witches come the equinox. That's how they get those spooky eyes. Enough! Take him down and put him in the interrogation room. I thought you died. I'm not so easy to kill. Introduced. Vernon Roach. <laughs> I'd shake your hand if I could. <laughs> yeah. it's, it's true. Walk around behind me if you want to shake. Well, how foolish of me. Vess! Unshackle him. No, thanks. 
Bring something to drink. We can't sit here, cotton mouth. You will tell me everything you remember. The entire assault. And all that happened in the solar. And if I refuse? I shall have to beat you. I've commanded the special forces for a while. Got good at beating others. You're a witcher. You'd endure much. You better believe it. Worst case scenario, you'll suffer through it, go back to your cell, and tomorrow, they'll publicly gut you, skin you, and hang you. Just like that? For nothing? No. For Temeria. Downright praiseworthy. Where should I start? It was a long day. I wish to hear the important bits. Okay, so basically this right here, <clears throat> this is covering the order of the stuff that he's recollecting back to. And I'm pretty sure, now don't, don't, don't quote me on this, but I'm pretty sure you have to do all of it regardless of what order you tell it in. Because uh, if you say, we split up the monastery, that's the, you know, that's the most recent thing that happened uh, in terms of relative to them right now. But I think he'll be like, oh, no, no, go tell me earlier stuff. I, I know what happened then. I mean, I think that's how it happened. So we're going to start here and just work our way back down. Um, so that's just my plan. Because, uh, again, sorry I don't remember your name, but whoever requested this game said, I like collectibles. Normally, I don't do collectibles in games, but I'm going to go out of my way to try and do as much as I can in this game. Because I've been wanting to play a game recently uh, that I could really sink my teeth into and really play for a long time. And th I think this can be the perfect starting point for, uh, my long playthroughs. So, let's start with, uh, The Morning the King Summoned Me. Witcher, are you up? <sighs> His Majesty, King of Tiberia, Pontar, Mahakam, and Sodden, Senior Protector of Bruges, summons Master Geralt to appear before him. Tell him I'll be there shortly. Sorry to intrude like this, milady, but the King... We heard you. <laughs> A pleasant day to you, milady. Witcher... Stupid when waged by your king. Uh, people are dying because of a lover's spat. They've cleared the forests, they're pillaging nearby villages, and they'll soon be murdering each other en masse. Why? Because Foltest's having a spat with the mother of his bastard twins. This is a really stupid war, Triss. Bastards or not, the children are still royal blood. The Lavalettes are an old Temerian dynasty, and the mix is sufficient basis to vie for the crown. History has known stranger contenders. Which doesn't change the fact that... I know. Altest and the other northern monarchs are neither the smartest nor the most refined. But they're kings, one of whom we serve. And I'll see Foltest is summoned, protect him if need be. But once the castle falls, we leave. Did you dream of the wild hunt again? Mm -hmm. uh, a scout reported seeing a dragon. One of the scouts swears he saw a dragon down by the river. Claims he ran into a Scoyotel unit. That would have been it. The L. 
bowed in prayer and he escaped. Drag in the organization? Is it not? Which Or has something changed? Nothing's changed. And you're right. It's probably not a dragon. Although it could be a forked tail or a slizzard. Maybe even an overgrown wyvern. The scout ran into some elves and scurried away. That's how that story begins and ends. Uh, learn anything about the assassin? The unlucky assassin? How did the autopsy go? It was a nightmare. In the months since you killed him, the king's medics poked around in his corpse like a bunch of amateurs. What arrived in that cart? Well, I wouldn't even call it a corpse. Foltest has some trust issues. Did you learn anything? His pupil suggested he could probably see in the dark as well as you. I couldn't put an age on him. The killer snuck past all the guards and nearly killed Foltest and me a month ago. And now you tell me he was a witcher? Possibly. I'm just saying what the autopsy showed. I haven't told anyone, nor do I plan to. I know what it could do to you if it got out. You might be a savior, a king's witcher now, but masters can be as fickle as the cults they ride. I get the feeling that dream's important. Running frantically through the forest. The wild hunt. They're the last things I remember. I wake up and try to relive the dream and the memory, hoping I'll find some guidance. Some clue to grab onto. Something that'll help me recover my memory. Dreams can be very powerful. Some people claim they can even shape reality. People claim a lot of things. The problem is, it's often nonsense. We'll know in time. I'm sure of it. Uh, time to go. All right. Time to look to the lustful king and his stupid war. I'll join you later. <laughs> Sounds good. Oh, beautiful. This game is so pretty. Uh, welcome to the prologue of The Witcher 2. This section of the game will introduce you to the story and the game world and help you familiarize yourself with uh, combat. Yeah, okay. Basically, these next three sections... Auto save from time to time. Manually save F5. Ah, look at that. I had no idea. Cool. Okay. The more you learn as you read. <laughs> Trebuchets are awesome. Like these giant fucking uh, catapult things. These are so cool. Oh, they still make them nowadays. Yeah, very rarely, you know, just for entertainment's sake. A beautiful sake, but, day for battle. But still, it's pretty Fear cool. Not, Excellency, we're out of range of their arbalists. I am no warrior, sir. I must admit. Finally, traitors of the realm boil tar on the walls while you dally with the royal advisor. How may I assist you, sire? We mount an assault today, and you'll be at my side. Follow me, gentlemen. Let's not keep the traitors waiting. Sire, you said we were out of range. That was a ballista, Excellency. Its arms strengthened with bronze plates and strung with horsehair. It can propel heavy bolts up to a mile away. A deadly and very costly weapon. An experienced crew can cock and release two bolts each minute. Yet it has one flaw. Your Grace, please take cover. The recoil of the arms is so strong upon firing that the weapon shifts. It simply cannot hit the same spot twice. I had no idea Your Grace was a learned military engineer. I'm not. I gave the Baroness those ballistae two years ago for her birthday. <laughs> Sire. What say you, Excellency, of men who live in spite of such wounds? And what say you, Your Grace, of soldiers who inflict them? Those who did this live no more. Master Gallant, I wish to converse with you once the storm of battle has subsided. I plan to the court as soon as possible. Who might I know why? Too often they take someone I'm not. What do they call you, soldier? Wait. You served with me at Brenner and during our foray into the Pontar Valley. Norman Sadel. Still an arbalist? 
Yes, sir. Fight has not been kind to me. Ha! Norman Sador, for your years of faithful service to the Crown, I appoint you Decurion of the Arbalists. Onwards, gentlemen. No reason to dawdle. Oh yeah, you're a uh, commander of the Monopoly crew now. Just <laughs> like that's some pointless name. <laughs> Whoa, that thing went flying fast. Forgive my candor, Your Majesty, but uh, I must ask, what fate awaits the royal bastards when they're my children? I hate the bastard. One more time, someone will die painfully. Your Grace, forgive me. But the laws of succession are irrefutably clear. Piss on the laws. I'll change them if need be. Above all, I'll not allow a band of treacherous barons to use my children as their banner. Your Majesty is entirely within his rights. Adder is dead. And I have no other children. I see. This conversation is over, Excellency. Please retire to your tent. Black ones in my camp before a battle. What has the world come to? Nothing would make me happier than returning his shriveled head to Emir in a sack. But Triss Merigold insisted I be patient and courteous. Was I? <laughs> As ever, sire. I couldn't have handled it better myself. Ha! I always knew you were one of And bugger what They talked about Adder no end. Have you learned anything about the assassin? Uh, ooh. Let me say nothing new. Nothing new, sire. A month's passed and we don't know any more than we knew when we began. This investigation's going nowhere. My agents have learned little also. But we'll find the culprits. It's just a question of time. Now for the battle. I want you at my side today. Then you may go where you please. Thank you, sire. Where are you aiming, imbeciles? Soldier! Spyglass! What is going on up there? The gods! Count at you, Barry! Cat switcher. Aim for the rogue with the red plume. Not six months ago, he swore eternal friendship to me. Quickly! How much higher? Okay, so for this part right here, uh, the way I always hit them is, you know, you think, oh, there's going to be a drop or whatever, but no, you can just basically pop it right there. And that should be good enough, I think. One and a half to Yeah, if, if he says one and a half, it should hit, unless it changes for some reason. There we go. <laughs> That's gnarly. <laughs> Did we hit the bastard? He's down. Ha! One less traitor. Time to attack. Follow me, Witcher! This thing reminds me of the thing from, uh, uh Lord of the Rings. The things that the trolls were pushing against the, the castle walls. Oh, and quickly, I am running this game off an SSD, so that's why the uh, load times are very, very quick. <laughs> yeah, to the top. You know, I. Louise. All you need to do is to kneel. Are you mocking me? Never mind. I'm certain Louise will realize her mistakes. Besides, children should have a mother. I'm lost. It's quite simple. Louisa and I had a bit of a tip. She made demands I could not fulfill. Understand? I think so. Count Echeverry and others immediately intervened, all noble, all sympathetic. They claimed the evil king would take her children. They would protect them, even place them on the throne. And the Baroness was duped. A motherly love used. In truth, they desire privileges that would weaken the throne. Taking orders, smash your bow! Going and country there, your wife! And a long road at your toe! <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> Shut up, that's not funny! <laughs> Red and vodka's all you'll get! 
When you're plowing for your king, blood. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty cool. Man, this is a good looking game. Oh, I'm just a big fan of Bloom and Dip the Field, though, so it really suckers me in. <laughs> on the bridge. We're nearly there. Weapons at the ready. That tower was ridiculous. It was designed to break the rebels' morale. A bunch of lords and lordlings took a ride to then pompously stride on top of the walls while the real army fought and died below them in the shit and piss-filled streets. If years of service have taught me anything, it's that the highborn don the best costumes and get the best vantage points, whether at a ball or in battle. But it's not the time for that kind of jousting, Witcher. Continue your story. Okay, on to the assault. After we came out of that tower. That is until we ran into Eric Led. Ooh, who's that? Let's do this. <laughs> Again, if I die a lot, just, you know, whatever. <laughs> Don't hate me too much. I want this guy. Oh, look at that. Nasty. Get out of here, you jerks. Nice. Fallen like a... I don't know. Some analogy. Metaphor. Analogy. I don't know. <laughs> Lord Suxon, you shall push for the center aisle and bring down that gate. It's a good day to kill, your majesty. Follow me, gentlemen. For Tamiria. That's not disturbing. Lord Swan, you and your men shall follow me. We must capture or otherwise deal with Arian Lavalette in order to break the defender's morale. Yes, Your Grace. Geralt, gentlemen, follow me for the glory! Fall back, God damn it! I forbid you to die like imbeciles! Hear me! They've taken a good position, the bastards! If this persists, they'll pick us up like lights, and I'm stuck. Any idea? Huh. That ballista would do the trick. Yeah, there we go. Defeat the ballista. Ballista's defenders and prepare to launch the bolt. Okay, so where are we going? Not down there. What about. Uh, how do we get down there? Do we walk down here? No, oh, yeah. Oh, okay. There we go. I just hope in the next, uh... In the next uh, Witcher, you uh, can jump and move on your own. Because I know it's open world, so I would assume you can, but... I really don't know. Right, let's get our sword out. Bring it on, you jerks. Nice. Oh, what you doing? <laughs> Look at that. And if that thing in the bottom right down there where it's giving me all my things that are happening, um, if that's annoying, I think I can remove that. So just let me know if that is uh, a little too annoying for you. Uh, let's do Igni. 
Let's try that, because this guy's a shield, so maybe that will help uh, move the shield or something. Whoops. Uh, don't roll into him! <laughs> okay. Is that it? What do I do with this now? Do I break it? Oh, there's still guys back here. What? Are they just... They just chilling? <laughs> Not doing anything? Hey, you jerk. I'm gonna wait till he fires and then I'm gonna, I'm gonna dodge him. Ow! <laughs> that wasn't a very good dodge, Tyler. <laughs> okay, now we can take care of this thing. Okay. There we go. Go! I've always hated these kind of things. You have to click fast with the mouse. I've never been very good at that. There we go. Eh, it should cause quite a bit of damage. Oh, hang on. Nice. So, on norm or on easy, it is very, very easy. So, I'll probably take a bit of a break before I actually, uh... Before I actually do the next session, you know, you guys will let me know if you would like to see a uh, normal difficulty or if I should just keep playing it on easy just because I enjoy it more. Can I just fire it and be done with it? <laughs> Why is that not an option? Whoa, hang on. Get out of here. I think I kicked him. <laughs> Nice. The tower men, storm the tower. What a hit! The that was awesome. With us. Okay, so we're heading back this way. Cool. Hey there, you jerks! No, I didn't want you. I wanted him. Stand your ground. No, you don't. Oh my! Wow, my fireball didn't. Uh, Fireball, whatever it's called. Fire, the, the fire thing didn't go all the way. I want to pick this up. Can I not? Whoa, hey! <laughs> I didn't see you there, dude. Aw. Oh, well, let me pick it up. Oh, well, whatever. Because normally when those bags are there, they have money inside them or something. But I, I guess it really wouldn't make a difference if I get money now or not. Uh, simply, can I pull myself up there? Yes, I can. Uh, simply because, like, you're not going to keep the money if you get it. I, at least I don't think so. Okay. Go this way. There we go. Geralt's here. Don't, oh, see, now we can search. That's weird. Short sword. Eh. And... Short sword. Two short swords, whatever. See, he didn't reach all the way. That was weird. Oh, let's do this guy. Nice. Oh, used all the magic up. Can't do it yet. Good job, King. Okay, where to now? This way? Man, this guy's crazy. Normally, don't see kings out in battle like this. Oh, sick. There we go. Anything in here? The door. Smash the door. Axeman. Give me splitter. Wine. I guess I might as well take it. Uh, I don't see anything here. I don't think any collectibles or anything will start popping up until we're past the tutorial, though. So, I'm not too concerned about it. Uh oh. Nice. Sick. This game's cool. One at a time, guys. Come on. Be courteous to each other. Um, I said one, one, <laughs> one at a time, not two at exactly the same time. Guys, 
Calm down! <laughs> Treated with honor. Go plow yourself, King. Wow. <laughs> Bury them in arrows. Come on, men. For Temeria. They're well shielded. You've got a better idea? It shouldn't be hard if the art. That's the son of Louise. Heir to these lands. He's hot tempered but good with a sword. Be careful. Reason with him. Let's see if Reason can reign over uh, Brawn. So we gotta level up. Let's jump into uh, our tree here. And obviously we're still level 2, so we can't improve the swordsmanship uh, or alchemy or magic. So let's go ahead and pop one of these things here. Yes, there we go. Uh, so level 3 will gain another talent. So that's cool. I like that. Ow. I like that system. It's pretty neat. Get out of here, you jerks! Ow! Ow! There we go. There we go. <laughs> Boom! Get out of here, you dumb soldier. Alright, let's get up there. Teach this kid a lesson. No. No. You don't want to. Don't want to climb the ladder. There you go. That was weird. And up we go. The famed Geralt of Rivia. You've fallen low, Witcher. Word has it you're one of the best swordsmen in the north. Time to test that rumor. Enough slaughter. Surrender and full test will treat you and your men with honor. And what guarantee is there that he'll not cut us down to the last? None. Full test defiled my mother. Now eludes with Nilfgaard. The king leads an army. You have few brain. In a minute you may lose even those. Choose. Hear that, men! We are to surrender, forgetting the very nature of honor and pride. We must choose. Shame or a witch's sword. Is that how you would live? Will you bow your heads before Faltest? Never! You heard them, Witcher. Uh... Drop your weapon, fool. Don't be a fool. This is no game. Your men don't need to die. Surrender, and the king will show mercy. My mother has seen enough of this king's mercy. What'll you do? Throw yourself on my sword? Run? He made mother a harlot, then denied her before all the realm. True enough. But no massacre, no misguided heroism will change that. Drop your weapons. Should anything happen to my mother, I shall find you and kill you. <laughs> what was that close up for? <laughs> that was weird. <laughs> 